What is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Big Blue Bug, back with a new episode of... I want to call it my time at Sandrock. Back with a new episode of uh, Swords and Sandals. This episode, I'm hopefully going to defeat the uh, the leader of this area. I'm better at this dude at everything except for attack, which is kind of surprising that I'm falling behind on attack now. But I guess I've thrown so many points into agility, it might make a little bit of sense. Start with those legs. Now them arms. Now maybe we just hit you with that old quick attack. Nice! That was super fast, actually. Yep, nope, we're just gonna keep it rolling. Let's just keep it let's just keep it rolling. I'm going for one more level and then we'll fight him. And then we can travel to the new area too. The other town. See if maybe we can put in a little bit of he has a lot of he has a lot of agility though. Ah. Good try. I just like to knock the agility out right off the bat. I don't even know if that actually does anything. I'd like to pretend it does. But your guess is as good as mine. He actually damage the like makes him lose anything. I don't think I reach this, do I? Damn, I didn't. Oh, that sucks. Aw, oh, man. Please stop drinking everything. What the hell was that? You guys see how far he walked? I'm gonna push you off this map if you do that again. You know what? F you, buddy. There it is. Regeneration's doubled. Yeah, walk back. Oh, you walk forward. Nice try, though. That was your, your grave mistake, buddy. Knock him over. I guess an agility build probably would have been cool. The fact that I'm seeing how far these people are moving around the map in the middle of a fight is pretty epic. That's the sound he made. This dude's all charisma stamina, actually. This dude's in it for the long haul. I'm sorry. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, man. I feel bad. What the heck? What was that? Oh, man. What the hell was that? Oh, that was terrible. Yeah, we'll take him. Oh, man. Who we got? Who's the champion? One hailed as one of the greatest rock musicians of his generation, Lord Brian fell out of favor with King... Come on! Oh, my goodness. I'm playing against freaking... What is this, Gene Simmons? I'm playing against Gene Simmons. It's Kiss. What are we looking at here? Wow! Come on! Did you guys see his 26 charisma? Well, he has nothing else but that charisma, though. Wait, is charisma the ability for the guitar? Immediately just messes up my armor. Amazing. Oh man, wait, he's already done? He's already done, bud? 
Yeah, you better keep swinging that guitar. That your charisma ain't doing you any any favors, man. That's all you got. Can I land one more hit here? Okay, yeah, he can't use a special of his skill. Okay, yeah. Just anything that'll hit here. Um, yeah, this is this will hit. All right, that was. I I don't know what to say to that one. I just absolutely destroyed Gene Simmons over here. Destroyed him. Okay. All hell biggin! That's me. Oh, yes, the one attack. I don't want this. Level five? Absolutely not. Um, Take the money, actually, here. I would take the stars, but... Nah, it's, it's irrelevant. Well, I guess that'd be how the cookie crumble, right? How the cookie a crumble. <sighs> well, I hold one more title. I'm the freaking Pokemon master, grabbing all them titles. Let's go to the overworld, I guess. It's that dude was a piece of the old cake. I'll make my way all the way up here. Yeah. Five days. What else do I need days for? Right? Adventure. Oh, I should have read that. The bay between Willard Sound and Clerg uh, used to be dominated by pirates. Nevertheless, the region's close proximity to Feytor meant it could be quickly reinforced against seafaring threats. And the buccaneers have since migrated to less defended waters. In the process of being bo booted out, crews were forced to leave behind their stashes, treasures, much of which is believed to be underwater car uh, ca caverns, caverns lining Clegg's coast. You couldn't resist jumping on the bandwagon when you heard those local legends and you have decided to try some cave diving in the hopes of striking it rich. As you arrive at the docks, a lineup of hopeful treasure hunters has already conjugated. Conjugated, yeah, and are handing their gold over to a red robed gentleman his, and his tall assistant, a lady clad in shimmering dark cloak. It appears the resident mages have a monopoly on the business. As you can see, the robed man's purse is near busting, bursting with coins. In return, each diver receives a vial of aqua liquid and a small crystal that glows intensely. You watch each, di each diver chug their vial and dip over the wharf edge with the crystal in hand. As you reach the front of the line and pay your two bits, the mage starts explaining safety guidelines in a bored drawl. You're too fired up to pay any heed and hurriedly snap up the gear, swill down the potion, and leap over the edge. So excited uh, are you that you forget to hold your breath and end up sucking in a mouthful of water. Much to your delight, however, you find the water is perfectly breathable and you waste no time descending into the deep ocean once you reach the seabed a number of cave openings are visible so you pick one at random lighting the way with your crystal you drift through the submerged tunnel and are greeted with the sight of a madrid of a marid fish zipping past when the tunnel branches into two paths you veer left and continue straight for a short length until the area opens up into an above water grotto heaving yourself up the steep embankment you step into a mossy cavern and begin searching its metal uh, shadow recesses an hour and a half an hour of of uh, scrounging through the craggy gr grotto yields no treasure though there is something glimmering beneath the lynchin the lynchin you pick away at the green covering to reveal specks of amber and blue embedded in the soft stone. The sandy rock comes away easily beneath your fingers and several multicolored gems fall into your hands. You admire the fistful of brilliant gems in the crystalline light before carefully pocketing them, backtracking to the cavern, dipping 
dipping below the water once again, you notice it is uh, become somewhat difficult to breathe. Your heart starts ra to race as you realize the effects of the potion are wearing off. You frantically push yourself back along the tunnel. Arriving at a junction, you find yourself unable to remember which path you took. The left path leans to the side, while the right path one continues straight. Neither are familiar from this angle. You mind, your mind screams at your decision as you are choking. Well, if you took the left there, you're taking the right out. You frantically swim down. Later that, uh, you frantically swim down uh, the path, and are relieved to see the entryway of the cavern with. Just seconds of breath uh, remaining, you erupt from the ocean with a mighty splash. Da -da -da. Later that day, you sell the stones for a tidy profit. It has been a profitable day. In truth, though, you think this diving business is a little dangerous for your tastes. Okay, uh, Clerk, once the, once the re revive... Reveled city-state of the Pigmen of Grag is now a land of cold winds in a high tundra fields, set against the breathtaking backdrop of Kragen Batch Mountains. Thanks to the efforts of Lord Owen uh, Shard Strike, the Agamitic, the Agamitic, and Trubulent Pigmen were driven from the land over a hundred years ago. Thanks to the vigilant, the vigilance and efficiency of the hunting parties here, Clerg's Hill have become less dangerous and as much, and as such many shepherds have set in up in the area. There you go. Oh man. I hate reading aloud if you guys haven't caught on. Whoa, it's so much better. But you know what? I don't want it. And you know why I don't want it? Because I might get a green one tomorrow. It's a new day tomorrow. I think that'll still be there. That I do want. I don't care about the cryromancer. The cape's so worthless. That's only 245. No. We'll check back tomorrow, because we need to wait the night anyways. Uh, I think we got one fight in. Yeah, I need to defeat five of them. That's fine. Let's defeat five of them. These people are about as hard as the last area. Maybe slightly harder, but... I should be able to defeat five of them pretty easily. One. Immediately throws fire at me. I hate you. Are you kidding me? Come on, one more hit. Thank you. What up, baby? Get on my level. What? Why? No XP? Ah, rude, really. See, they still have the maze. I don't want this maze. It's so much better, though. Maybe. Maybe in a little bit. No XP, that's rude. Oh, see, club mastery and intelligence? Yes, please. Anything else new I want? I'll just buy the cape, because why not? So who in here can I fight for XP game? Can I fight these harder people for XP game? Like, can I defeat this guy for XP game? I need to defeat them anyways. Aren't we the 
the same breed? Is that the right word? Come on, give me XP for that. Come on, he's not that bad. Thank you. Wow, I gained a thousand gold for that? Well, I guess we'll try the next guy. I hope I get XP for him too, but I don't know. I might not. Like, it sucks because I have to fight him anyways. Like, I have to do five wins, right? Not even close, buddy. Reach this jump, maybe. Now, if I don't have the stamina for it, that was. Bad news. I can't imagine it's going too well for you. It's just stamina regeneration stuff. Let's go. Oh, wow. He hit me pretty far, actually. Quit throwing your gosh darn weapon. I hate it. Yeah, drink your potion. Oh, he's down. Come on, come on, XP, XP, XP. Please, please, please. Let's go! I was nervous I would stop getting XP for all these. That would stink. Um, I didn't actually check her shop. Let me check it real quick. Oh, wait. No, that's for... I thought that was one of those consumables. Do you not have any of those con consumables that, like, improve you permanently? That's not. Why do I think that was a thing? Okay, let's jump to another fight. How many more fights do I need before I can, uh... Like, these people are so low level now. I've outleveled all of them. Yeah, look at that. Oh, this dude has a lot of attack, though, but I can't imagine it being anything of, uh, anything of challenge, at least. Ten. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, I hit him in the chest. Oh, okay, his head just blew up. This is My enemy was too low level. God! Oh, I hate it. In three days. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll sleep through the night. I don't know. I almost never sleep through the night. Because we're always, you know, setting up for, uh. Yeah. Uh, we need to defeat one more. Let's take this guy. I can't imagine this going too well for him. Yeah. My vitality and defense both. What's wrong with them? My, my twin brother's here. Bring the party. He's pointing at my guy. What's wrong with him? Yeah, he's... He, he's got some eyes, all right. Oh, look at this little guy. So oh, look at that. Broke your leg. Now I'm going to go for the leg shot. Oh, okay. Two shot. Let's go. That wasn't actually. That one was just right. Well, you know, that means that we could fight the boss, which we will do in that next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Watching, I appreciate everyone's time and viewership. If you guys are enjoying the series, make sure you hit that like button and make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any more spicy swords and sandals content. Other than that, guys, I'll see all of you in that next video. Bye!